Hello everyone, this is Gemini Jets 9715 here. I'm coming at you with a Gemini Jets and Arrow Classics model review. Today, this is a triple review, as you can see. Today, I'm reviewing the JetBlue Airbus A321, the Virgin America A320 with Sharklets, and the Southwest Boeing 737-700. Now, let's start off with the Virgin America. So this is the version America Airbus A320, um, by me by Aero Classics. This is the uh, Sharklets. Now let me tell you about this. I looked under this under magnification. All the print is good. The name of this aircraft is Jersey Girl. The registration is November 361 Victor Alpha. The Sharklets are uh, good under magnification. The engines are not colored in. Um, the undercarriage is good, as you can see here. Uh, no Aero Classics uh, logo. I don't know if that's customary for Aero Classics. Version tail. Um, the sharklets look good, and the flag design is clear under magnification. And my review of this, I, I, I know I'm not going into true de true detail about it, but this plane is awesome. I love this. Aircraft. This will serve Los Angeles for my airport, and um, I can't believe this is such a good aircraft. Uh, when I got it, I literally got it like, like five, ten minutes ago, and I op this one was the first one I opened because this one was the first box. Um, but this aircraft is nice, but it doesn't top the uh, the other one, the other uh, Sharklet aircraft that I have right now. Uh, I'm going to be reviewing. So let's move on to the Southwest. And let me have you well aware, these models, I just got them, I opened them only once before, and as you guys know, I don't go over the boxes. So, this is the Southwest Boeing 737-700. Now I did look under this on, on magnification as well, I looked under all the models under magnification. All the print is clear and eligible. Uh, I can see the good flag design on the aircraft. For linear, um, I think the flag is good. The winglets, um, it's hard to tell, but they do say southwest.com. And this is a pretty good aircraft. I like this aircraft a lot. This will serve um, Orlando, Florida, and Las Vegas on uh, seasonal routes uh, to Las Vegas so that was that's my review of it um, but also it's it's my first Southwest model um, that was my first version America model this is my first Southwest model so um, I just <laughs> I'm having a lot of first in this uh, triple review and I know I should be making like five minute reviews on each one having each one separately done and people are not going to like this but this is the best way I can get this done so this is the southwest let's just top down view now the floats are painted red like and clear and on the uh, box it flaps down flaps I think it's flaps 30 or flaps 49 I'm sure that I have no idea though don't ask me I just gave a guess now let's move on to the jet blue so this is the JetBlue Airboss A321. Now this has a lot of detail with it. I cannot believe how detailed this aircraft is. Now, um, if you have seen the September releases, it's rival American. Um, it's a rival aircraft. The American A321 has been released uh, for pre-orders. So this aircraft, I I love this aircraft. I This is my first JetBlue aircraft. And boy, oh boy, I couldn't make a better decision. So, um, just the door detail is nice. Uh, the name of this aircraft is Bigger, Brighter, Bluer. And the registration of the aircraft is November 903 Juliet Bravo. Um, the prism tail, um, JetBlue.com, um, JetBlue Sharklets, still the color blue color. Um, the four boarding, the four doors, um, 
I've seen, I've heard from people that a Jeff Luis is the L1 door, not the L2 door, like some people are thinking, or I don't know. Um, but Jeff Blue, this is a good point. Um, there is no satellite dish because I think when they made the model, when they were using prototype images, um, the uh, real aircraft didn't have the uh, sat sat uh, satellite uh, dome. So this is just the opposite side. The only difference is it has the cargo doors and the baggage holds. Um, and then the prism tail again. So um, I like this aircraft a lot. Um, it's an awesome plane. If you can see one in your uh, local hobby, if you can see one on like online or something, you know this plane is very nice. I recommend it. If you have a JetBlue hub or if you have a New York uh, area airport, definitely. Um, I, my airport's in Northwest Connecticut, so I uh, my airport's my, the location's Northwest Connecticut, but. Um, so, that wraps up the conclusion of this, um, review, um, thing. So, uh, now I'm going to show you the airport. And many of you will freak when you see this. Yeah, it's under construction, no. Uh, yes, it's seriously under construction now. Um... So, this is just one part of the airport, this is the domestic concourse, so, why do I have international heavies over there? Just to test out taxiways. Uh, this is coming along nicely, I like this a lot, and, um, this is pretty cool. Uh, I have one, two, three, four, five United Gates, four Delta Gates. Up to six American gates. Um, the six American gates are right there. So one, two, goes one, two, three, four, five, six. And that's how it's going to be done. Um, then Delta has four here, and United has five here. Um, and then Hawaiian, and then on the other side. We have four wide body aircraft gates. Um, so, like the Delta 744, the American Triple Two, United 787. Okay, let me just do a quick review of the 787. I just realized I haven't done a review of this aircraft, and this aircraft is beautiful. Um, the registration on this is M279901. So, um, but this aircraft is wonderful. I like this. This is a new model as well. I got this a couple of weeks ago. And it's just beautiful. Um, Hawaiian 763, you all know him. All know the American and the Delta. Um, and then you all know the Air New Zealand and stuff like that. So, um, and the Lufthansa's. And so there's a lot of cool things up here uh, that are, I'm using to test out the uh, airport with. So, um, I'm gonna leave you with a tail shot of the uh, Delta of the American and Delta. So um, that's a mini update and um, um, triple model review. So uh, I'll see y'all later. Okay, bye.